This is an apical four-chamber view of a hyperdynamic left ventricle in a patient presenting to the emergency department with hypotension and fever. A phase array probe is used and placed at the point of maximal impulse, usually just below the left nipple or at the inframammary fold with the probe marker pointed towards the left axilla. In this clip, we can appreciate four chambers seen here, left atrium, left ventricle, right atrium, and right ventricle. Notice that in this clip, the endocardial excursion and thickening of the left ventricle is increased, in this case, leading to near obliteration of the left ventricle cavity during end systole. Identification of a hyperdynamic left ventricle can be useful during assessment of acute unexplained hypotension or dyspnea and can represent hypovolemia or peripheral vasodilation, in this case from sepsis. While a hyperdynamic left ventricle frequently suggests hypovolemia or vasodilation, other etiologies that can severely decrease preload or afterload should also be considered, many of which will have accompanying abnormal findings on cardiac ultrasound, such as massive pulmonary embolism or cardiac tamponade. Furthermore, high output states due to various etiologies such as thyrotoxicosis, anemia, or infection can also be considered.